What is up everybody? Video Addict here and I have SHTF. As you notice, I have an accomplice here today. I'm gonna turn it off so it'll stop doing that. That's just a little toy I got from my, god my goddaughter, Olivia. Super excited. <laughs> it's so freaking awesome. I don't know, it's just... I needed it. I needed it. I needed the light. I needed the lightness. The laughter. I needed it. Alright. This one, it seems like all the boxes are taking forever this month, man. They just, they're being stupid. They're like not getting their stuff in on time. Uh, this one seemed like it was delayed, but I don't know. It might not be. But Hunter's Hall was delayed. Hunt Vault was delayed. Uh... Barrel of Blade was delayed. I mean, it's just everything is delayed. It's crazy. Oh, fantastic. All right, so, all right. We got some cool stuff here. I like, I like what I'm seeing. This is the regular 1999 box. Uh, this is not the all-in, you know, everything, which I'm usually okay with, and I think I'm going to be okay with this time. But this is your box. Pause as you see fit. And there's the pro and elite boxes. You can read what was in them. Here's a little picture of everything on the other side. And what they're saying about it. All right. We're going to get right into this because this is my box. It's the basic box. They're saying this month's value is $55.94. I paid $19.99, so let's get right into it and see what we got. First off, I got a little bit of duct tape. This will be the mystery survival accessory. <laughs> That's what this is going to be because I don't see it anywhere in there. It's duct tape. Uh, it's a small roll. I've gotten this a few times. I have some rolls in the other room. It's all good. Uh, never, never didn't have too much duct tape, really. All right, next up is going to be, I guess we'll get this, 40 waterproof matches times four packets. That's going to be 60. 160 waterproof matches. Uh, that's going to be a $4.99 value. Hey, waterproof matches, I've got a bunch of them, but hey, nice to have. Next up is going to be... Let's go ahead and get this out of here. This is going to be the Trailblazer 3-in-1 Auto Emergency Tool. Okay, this here, the Auto Emergency Safety Hammer. I, don't, I feel like I have one of these already. And that's fine. I can give it to somebody. There's a little something you stick in your car. You know, you get a little... Crank here to get your light charged on the end, which is cool. Then you have your glass breaker right there, and your seat belt cutter right there. So pretty cool. You got a hand crank to keep your light flashing. You know, cool deal. Nothing really fancy, but definitely something. Throw it in your glove compartment. Throw it under. Throw it down in the door of your truck. Uh, you never know. Pretty handy little flashlight, if nothing else. Seatbelt cutter. It's all right. I mean, at four ninety nine or well nine ninety nine, I think that's a little pricey because it's kind of cheap feeling. But if it saves my life getting out of my truck, then it was worth the nine ninety nine. Next up is gonna be 
our LED zoomable 150 lumen 3W headlamp. AAA batteries, AAA batteries, where are you at? I have found just enough to make this work. I had to go chase them down, but we'll see what this does. Okay. And... Boom! That's pretty bright, actually. Zoomable. Ooh. Pretty cool, man. I like it. It zooms. You know, it's zoomable. Boom. Boom. That's actually pretty nice for... Oh, and it's got like an SOS feature. You got your bright, dim SOS. Cool. I like it. I like it a lot. Very cool, man. It actually works really good. It's pretty good brightness. Hey, handy little thing there. Uh, $14.99? No. Uh, it is very cheap feeling. I don't feel like it's going to last very long, but it is cool and it will be a great emergency flashlight since I have a lot of these and I have a lot more expensive ones. So, but I will definitely throw it in my truck as like an emergency for sure. All right. Next up is going to be my. Shadow Warrior Stone Washed Assisted Open Pocket Knife. Now this, this is where the high quality comes in. At $9.99. Ooh, it's got like a gold belt clip. Look at that. Look at the detail. That's pretty neat. It's like a Damascus wannabe, but the actual uh, design on it is like a raised design. So, it is a liner lock, alright? Um, I don't know. I mean, I don't... I mean, it's sharp. I don't know how long it will stay sharp. There are no details on the metal or anything like that. Uh, I guess I got the, the blue version. There's a blue and a gold. Mine looks awfully black. But, you know. <laughs> it is a heavy, heavy knife. But... Uh, it's not centered in the opening. I think I talked about that once before, where it's supposed to be centered in there, but it's a little bit off to this side, but that's another Doc P thing he taught me about. They should, they're supposed to be centered. But it is a $9.99 knife. It is something that a small child would, or I say small child, don't give it to your small child. But, like, if you want to give it to your 14 year old or something like that, as a cool little thing, it's got a little skull samurai warrior on it. You know, whenever you, whenever you open it, the whole knife kind of vibrates. It's like, ding. <laughs> it's, kind of, it's a funny feeling. But, you know, as I said, Many times before, it is what it is. It's a nine dollar ninety nine cent knife. Um, definitely gonna be a. Uh, you know who I'd send this to? If 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 Doc P didn't get the SHTF box, I'd send it to him just just to, just to mess with him, man. Just be like, hey dude, check this out. I thought it was pretty neat. <laughs> Tell me your thoughts. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure he's gonna have up his own review. And you'll you'll know pretty sure what, what he thinks of it. All right, last but not least is the SHTF Jungle Tanto Machete, a twelve dollars and ninety nine cent value. Um, you know, 
I, I don't I don't know. We'll just open it up and see what we think. All right, so the sheet, not really that great, but not the worst I've ever seen. Uh, Hunt Vault was pretty bad with that one that they sent out, so. All right. It's got a little weight to it. This is not a very thick machete <laughs> but uh you get some okay teeth on the back that sucker is sharp though I'll tell you that right now maybe it ain't I don't know it feels sharp but I guess it's not very, like a cutting sharp man I don't know what do I got here do I got something that I can cut uh I know I got a bill around here somewhere. It's just dying to get shit caught, cut up. Yeah, I don't need this. All right. You know, I mean, it's... I mean, it cuts, but it's cut, it cuts like a little rough. Like, see how it's kind of, it's not a smooth cut? But, I mean, it just slices right through it. It does slice. You know. Anyway, that's it. That's all I got for you. Um, it's got some little oil on it or something. I'll clean that up or whatever. But it's pretty neat. You know, I mean, it's a little hacker. Whatever. It's got a rubber, gr rubber grip. This is plastic. Uh... I would not say that this is full tank because it's awfully heavy on that end. Like, there's nothing down here I don't feel like. But, uh, yeah, man, I mean, for just a, a beat-around knife, I like it. I like it. All right, that's it. That's all I got for you. Tell me what you liked. Tell me what you didn't. And the comments below. Like, share, comment, all that fun stuff. And, you know, subscribe. I'm out. See you later.